Hello, I'm Andrew and welcome back to Production Line Alpha. We are currently trying to produce a car every eight seconds. We're almost at our goal. What we're waiting for right now is to unlock robotics, which should get us to eight seconds. We're also seeing if we're going to be selling our cars. Then I think it's power, because, you know, we spend a lot of money on power. Oh, we are selling our cars. Sweet. We've got like 70% margin at the moment, so that's pretty good money right there. Of course, right now we are overtaxing our imports. What we need to do is get some faster imports as well. That would help. All right, next project. Quite honestly, we should go straight to power production. It's only 600. And I would like to build... No, I wouldn't like to build. I'd like to see which one of these is like... 8.2 seconds. Let's upgrade you. Extra robots. Expensive. Increased power consumption, but the speed is 10%. There we go, we're under our 8 second margin. Ooh, look at the money coming in. Very nice. But yeah, we're definitely going to increase the speed at which uh, stuff gets through here. We're actually sitting on quite a lot of insufficient resources right now. That's not good. That's the delay in the production line. Quite a significant delay, especially when it comes to doors, because each car needs four doors. That said, I was about to say, normally I see that the issue is when you get wheels, because, you know, each car needs four wheels. And as you can see, we are getting resource problems around here as well. Also valves. Right. Well, now that's done. We'll get improved efficiency. We'll get some faster resource conveyances. But, I'm going to go for power plant. And I'm going to try and fit them in where I can. Yeah, it's the only three. I mean, there's a four across there. Yeah. I think we're probably going to have to switch back to just taking up a large area with power. That's research, not power. God damn it. Um, yeah, power here. And then, doo -doo 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 -doo. boost the speed of overhead delivery. Okay, boost speed at which resource importers place resources on conveyor. But I guess that one. I don't really know what the big difference is, but you know, I'll probably end up with both of them. So, yeah, two more pounds. We should make it. Yeah, we're occasionally using power, but. For now, that'll probably do. Unless I can see like a nice three spot. Eh, up here is like a not bad spot. It's not great, but... Ooh, actually, this area is extra wide. There we go. We'll also then get ourselves a few more research offices as well, I think. That's 50% extra research offices. We could probably get more. I'm tempted by another five, but that would put us down to a quarter mil. Right. Faster resources. Go. And you know what? I'm going to spend that money. More research. Two, three, four, five. And I've blocked off this. Whoops. I mean, you can delete research houses later on, once you've got everything unlocked. Our cars are starting to pile up now. Maybe people are, like, looking for aircon or something in their cars who can't really afford this, like, premium. I'm going to lower our premium to about 60% now. Yeah, we're selling our cars again, which is great. Um... Now I can do uh, power plant efficiency. The reason I doesn't, I don't tend to do that, is because I know you can get more power. You know that's great, but I need to click on every power plant to upgrade them, and there's a lot of power plants, and quite frankly, that's annoying. That's my entire reason. It's annoying. I have the best reasons. 
We should start getting some like upgrades for our cars because I feel that people are not buying them because maybe, you know, they don't have like, I don't know, heaters in the car. That seems to be a bit of a, is it? Oh no, yeah, it's, it's heater. It's just a basic heater, yeah. We should probably have that in our car. Now you're still having problems up here. What I might do is section you off from the rest of the area. Hmm. Or do we need like another importer? It could probably be dealt with like by another importer. Right. Uh heater. Okay, get resource import here. And then I'm gonna cut you off from up here. I have no idea what I just deleted. Oh, I did delete the right thing. I want to. I want to delete the. Not exactly what I was intending. Which way is it meant to go? That way. Yes. But now this is cut off. Right. That'll take some of the strain off you. And it's working beautifully. Look at that. This one's flaring up occasionally, but other than that, it's good. I mean, I could have put, like, some supply, like, areas in, so we've got, you know, supply stockpiles around when you need to pull stuff out. But generally, they only help when they're, like, right next to the thing, I find. And because I've designed it to be really compact, which I probably shouldn't have done, I should have probably put, like, loads of space in, uh, that's not going to help. All right, we've got heaters done. What what do you think you have in a car after a heater? Let's do aircon, because, you know, we can put that in a car. It's easy enough to do. Heaters, where do those go in? Apparently in the seats. We're making good money though. And you will be the headlight fluid two. You're like 65%. Making about 10 grand on a car. Aircon. Lovely. Now we could start making stuff on site. And that is very tempting. But again, I'm not sure how efficient it would be for us because our area is pretty ridiculously sized. Um, heated seats, sunroof, maybe people want a sunroof. I mean, they probably want electric windows. Like, that's a pretty basic feature that maybe people want. Right, where is accessories? Aircon. And it is... Ah, it's not a nice sized area. That doesn't help. Ah, uh, that really doesn't help at all. Technically, I can put it here. I can, like, delete some things, so it's not the worst. Aircon. Bam. Conveyor. Done. Power plant. Power plant. Power plant. Sweet. Oh, no root stock power. Sorry! Right, convenience features. So we're looking at electric windows. You're the headlight fluid three. We'll try and push for 70% on this if we can. Yeah, like 11 and a half grand is a pretty good margin, I feel.
You've got seven in stock, nine in stock, four in stock. Like the heater, nine hundred extra dollars. Aircon, an extra nine hundred. Seems pretty decent to me. That said, they're not really shipping right now. Which I'm not worried about. I've got enough cash in the bank. Like, if I need to sell them, I can decrease the cost. We've got electric windows. I could start installing those. I think I will. And then I'm going to start focusing on other things. So, I mean, maybe we should do it with the in-car music. I promise you can't really roll it at the same time. So, we'll get in-car music as well. So, windows. Where do I find those? It wouldn't be under windscreen. It would probably be under doors. Oh, I imagine it'll be under doors at least. No. Roof. Arches. Bottom trim. Are you sure it's not under doors? It's really not under doors. Uh, engine assembly. It won't be an engine assembly. Radiator. Exhaust. Wheel assembly, steering, lights, nope, horn, seats, I mean the heat was in the seat, so, windscreen, am I missing it somewhere? New upgrade, electric windows, fit windows. Okay, so it's to the fit window area. Okay. Let's get income music. Fit window area. I'm just missing this area completely. Like, okay, what point do we fit windows? Right. Have you got windows? Maybe. I mean, honestly, shouldn't you put the windows in after you spray the body? I don't know. Maybe? Fit doors. No. Okay. It's got to be after fit doors. You can't really fit a window if you don't have a door to fit it to. So. Look at those. That looks like... It looks like the glass to me. Okay, goes in here, goes in here, goes in here, goes in here, goes in here. Engine assembly! Really not going to be the engine assembly. Radiate! Re oh, I don't even need to like look at that. Like I know it's not in the radiator area. Exhaust. No. Wheel. It's never going to be in the wheel. Steering. Why, why do we even bother looking at these places? Lights. Look at this area already. Horn. Why do I even bother? Windscreen. I tried. I really did. Electronics. I really thought for a moment it might be under electronics. It did say fit windows, right? Like, am I... Oh, let's go up here. Fit body frame. Fit door. Fit door panel. Fit window. Okay, so I can't do that because it requires me to have fit window, not just fit door. And I can't do it as a subsection of fit door. My guess is this probably is a bug. Uh, it should be... You should be able to apply the upgrade here but you need to specifically have a fit window area. Okay. Fine. I feel a little bit more vindicated now. I mean, I was looking in the engine assembly for how to install my electric windows, but I thought maybe they'd be misplaced or something, you know, bug fixing. I'm just being helpful, shush. Why am I not selling cars? Everything's overpriced. Okay, we'll bring you down 50%. We're just getting rid of old stock. Bring you down to a touch above that one and bring you down as well by like a grand. Four, nine, oh, eight. Yep, those are selling. You're still at 30 here. And then we've got our in car, like entertainment. There we go. Great. Well, we should probably start figuring out how to like make our own axles and fuel tanks, etc. We'll start on maybe like. An even better car. Like a production area that gets a car every six seconds. Or less. I'm tempted by less. I gotta say, tempting. Very tempting. 
Uh, but for now, we're going to go with, like, every six seconds. And we'll try and make all the stuff on the site if we can. So, Axle Manufacture. We'll need to knock that one out. I think we're selling. Are we not selling those? Okay. Get you down to about 10 grand profit. So, we're in less than 60% margin now. Which isn't that bad, I guess. Uh, in Car Music. And you are the Headlight Fluid 4. And I think we're going to try for like a 55% premium now. Yeah, you haven't sold particularly great. I'll decrease you a little bit more to just get rid of the old stock. Oh, that's the Headlight Fluid 4. Whoopsie. Nope. That's Axel. Let's do Fuel Tank Manufacturer. Okay, we've got the three and the eight. Sorry, the three and the four. The three needs to be discounted a little bit more. We're up to one and a half mil, though. Nothing seems to be bottlenecking, really. A lot of imports here is one thing, but it is tending to clear them. Ish, he says, looking on in horror as they pile up. Okay, we did axles and stuff. What comes after that? Body specialization. So we need bumpers, we need door. There's a lot of stuff to do here. Quite honestly, I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up spending like a lot of money on research. I really wish I could just queue up a load of research because manually going through this is going to be tiring. We're also definitely going to need a new area. Probably this one up here. I'm going to try and spread it out enough that I can have, like, manufacturing going on next to the things. And then enough importers. How many imports have I got? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'm going to have to make sure they don't touch too much. But it should be fine. Ooh, two exports next to each other. Maybe we should try and get a three-second car throughput. Two exports next to each other. We could do that. There's two exports up here as well. Ooh. We could try for 1.5 seconds. It'd be ridiculous. We could try for it. You know me. Ridiculous is kind of my middle name. It's not. It could be. Right. I put down one. So I need to put four more down because I want to put them down in batches of five. Uh, one. Two. Three. So I need to put one more down. It's gonna be really annoying when like research is popping up every like two seconds, but chop. By the way, I really should hold like shift and then place multiple. You can't. I need four more. Okay. Uh, door specialization. Yes, do it. One. Two, three. It's a lot of research. Okay, how are we doing? You've nearly sold out. You've got quite a lot building up. We could do the manufacture afterwards if we leave space for it next to the. Maybe. Maybe the most important thing is just to make sure we've got the specializations ready. What comes after that? Paint. But would we know the timing on these things? Like, I know that I can definitely bring the timing down with robots on, like, all the things that have robots by 22.5% with the max robots. Hmm. I probably need to do the paint stuff. going to take ages. Yeah, you know, you can take ages while I just figure some stuff out. We need to figure out the price on this car. It's not selling. Alright, so it doesn't seem to be based on margin or anything. It seems to be based on percentage. 
Because, it's you know, this is vaguely just sort of sold. So I can bring you down to about 50% as well. A little bit less than 50%. I don't know what, like, the economics is. Like, there's, there's no way to see why a car is not selling. And, of course, it's, you know, only one parameter you can really change. Like, you change features and stuff, but you don't know what those features are having an impact, like, on the market. You don't know, you know, how the market likes certain features, what are required. Like, I assume that, you know, certain features are kind of required after a while. Like, people assume you need heaters in your cars. Yeah, I need to decrease this just to get rid of the old stock. That was fast. That was an expensive upgrade. Uh, we'll get, like, faster drying, etc. Okay, look, we just need to get rid of those. There we go. You're selling nicely now. Too nicely. I'm going to get you back up to, like, 40%. Mmm. Still collecting. Still collecting. Okay, down a little bit. Faster drying. Turbo drying. And then we're going to do the max power drying, which is super expensive. In terms of research. Are we selling 38%? That's 38. Like, eh, no. Okay, we'll bring you down to like 35. There we go. You know what? It's kind of working. It's kind of working. I mean, this episode, what have we really done? Uh, we've we've tweaked. We've tweaked. We've twerked. We've twocked. Don't don't twock. By the way, those of you who don't understand what twocking is, which is probably most of you, uh, that is, I think it's a legal term for like taking without owner's consent, which is where you like nick someone's car. You you're not necessarily stealing it because you might return it. Yes, it's technically stealing, etc. But like people will be like, oh, well, I meant to return it. You just said like it's taking without owner's consent. Um. We'll do max power drying. It's going to take like a year to do. But for now, I've been at Relysium. Uh, next episode, I think what we'll do is we'll just like open straight up with starting to put the basics in. And while we start building our thing, we'll have the research going in the background. And we'll try and make a... We'll try and make a three second. My plan is we'll try and start up here. And we'll try and get down to here in three second. If we can do it, we can maybe replicate it and come around to here. And then the middle have manufacturing. Which will manufacture like all the stuff we need to add to either side. Maybe. I don't know if it'll work. But we'll give it a good try. For now, though, I've been at Relisium. If you enjoyed, like, you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. And, of course, until next time, stay shiny. Also, comment down below, because apparently that's, like, super important for you YouTube channel algorithm these days. So, you know, if you want to, go ahead. I mean, if you don't want to, you don't have to, I guess. I mean, I can't persuade you. Maybe I can. You want to comment down below. You are feeling sleepy. You aren't feeling sleepy. You actually want to watch more of my videos. Ow. I'm doing that like hypnotist like hand wave like gesture and then I realized I'm doing it with my broken arm which that hurts. Bye.